The video review will start in a few seconds, but if you're watching this on YouTube, remember if you have a question, comment, or suggestion for me, you can post it on 3dgameman.com and the link is provided below. Hello again, I'm Rodney Reynolds from 3dgameman.com and welcome to another video review. Today I'm looking at the Noctua NHU14S CPU air cooler. A great looking box with your typical white and brown color theme with pictures as well as features and specifications about the product all over the box. Now let's open it up and see what's inside. Everything is very neatly packaged on the inside and in individual boxes. You have an accessories box, the secure firm two mounting system for Intel as well as for AMD. Below all of this, again packaged very well. And the cooler comes with the fan already installed. This is a bit of a time saver. And they have a piece of protective plastic on the base plate. So in these boxes, they include the mounting hardware for installing just about any current AMD or Intel CPU. And you can contact Noctua if you need an optional bracket that doesn't come with this particular cooler. Now as well, they include this accessory box and in it is this, I'll just detail what is included. A Phillips screwdriver, two clips for installing an optional fan, NTH1 thermal compound, a whole tube of it, as well as a four pin low noise adapter, a case badge, as well as four soft mounts and these go on the optional fan to prevent vibrations when the fan is installed against the heatsink. Now let me first go through the specifications and then I'll have a closer look at it. Now this CPU cooler is compatible with just about any socket that is currently on the market. I'll list on the screen now what it is actually compatible with. But if you have a socket that it doesn't fit, ask not to and they might have a bracket for it like for example the LGA 1366. Ask them if they have it, they will send it along. Now let's go through some of the dimensions and materials and all that kind of stuff. So the overall dimension on this is not super large. I mean, it's pretty tall, but it's also pretty narrow as you can see here. So this is designed to fit in just about any case on just about any motherboard. And by the way, this is Intel LGA 2011 memory compatible. Don't worry about if you're installing this on an LGA 2011 socket and you know maybe you're wondering if it's going to hit the memory it shouldn't because it's compatible with that now the dimension that i'll be giving you here will be just for the heat sink itself and not the fan on it the height is 165 the width is 150 the depth is 52 millimeters with the fan though it is 165 high 150 wide and the depth is greater because of the fan 78 millimeters and the weight without the fan in case you want to use this particular heat sink by itself is 770 grams but with the fan it is 900 and 35 grams. Now the heatsink itself is comprised of copper and aluminum. The base plate is copper as well as the heat pipes, but the many cooling fins are aluminum. By the way, all the joints are soldered and everything is nickel plated. The fan that's included is a Noctua NF-A15 pulse with modulation fan. And in fact, this fan is 150 millimeters wide, but it fits in a 140 millimeter frame. So that's pretty cool. The bearing that they include is the latest SSO2. Maximum rotation speed is 1500 RPMs. The maximum rotation speed with the low noise adapter connected is 1200 RPMs and the minimum rotation speed is 300 RPMs. The maximum acoustic noise is 24.6 decibels but with the low noise adapter connected it is quieter at 19.2 decibels. The input power is 1.5 watts and the mean time before failure is around 15,000 hours. And by the way, this cooler comes with a six year warranty. Okay, so let's have a closer look first at the fan. This is a beautiful fan, I have to say. It has these marks and pitting, which is there for a couple of reasons, to move the air and also to keep it nice and quiet. Note that the fan has these bumpers on them. These are rubber 
and these will absorb any vibrations and as I mentioned earlier they include more if you are installing another fan and it's good to have some optional ones just in case these tear rip or something happens to them like maybe you lose them and as I mentioned as well braided cable four pin lead the heatsink itself pretty narrow but tall has some branding here at the top lots of heat pipes here at the base which is very very smooth now this is a fantastic design because the heat will be dissipated through the base plate itself into these heat pipes up into the mini fins a design that works exceptionally well and of course then the fan or fans will move that air out of the case Noctua has done a brilliant job with this CPU cooler. They've coupled an amazing heatsink with a super fan. That combination always works. Now, this CPU cooler might be a little bit more expensive than the competition. However, keep in mind that this particular product is quality all the way. You've got a nice solid copper base, copper heat pipes, many, many aluminum fins. They are soldered joints and nickel plated and a fan here that is just outstanding. And remember as well, it comes with a six year warranty. You can also add another fan on this heatsink if you wish and they do include clips for that so pretty much this cpu cooler is win-win no matter how you shake it without a doubt this is a 100 kick-ass product until next time take care i hope you enjoyed this video review and please note that pricing for this product is available on the 3d game man video review page